Hi, my name's Dave Goodman, and um, I'm making a, a series of videos uh, together with Yamaha Music. And um, the idea of this series of videos is an introduction to, to fingerstyle guitar and many of the things that I do with fingerstyle guitar. For example, slide, open tunings, standard tunings, drop D, how to get your right hand going together with the chords and the melodies with the left. Um, the first simple workshop that we're going to do um, is actually, it's called Free Your Fingers, and this is part one of a two-part uh, workshop. The, the notes for this workshop are available from uh, the magazine Acoustic Player in case you want to get them later on. So what we do is uh, we use a drop D tuning, which is standard, for example here, E, B, G, D, A, and instead of E on the low string, we go to a D, one tone lower. So what we have now is um, the possibility of playing an octave without having to, to hold a chord. A lot of finger style guitar like Travis picking and Chet Atkins picking and, and, and so on is largely based on an octave or a fifth which is running in the bass all of the time. Um, and what we want to do to begin this whole process is to get your thumb working very like at a slow medium tempo on this octave here and what you can do is you can sit and watch television drink beer with your left hand and just get a nice hypnotic groove going here with your thumb now, in, in typical finger style guitar, um, apart from really fancy uh, decoration notes and so on, most of what we do is, is quarter notes and eighth notes together with this bass line. So, for example, um, just to get started, let's play a, a high D here on the E string. Um, most of what we do is a combination of quarter notes and eighth notes um, together with this bass. So if I play the melody on one together with the, with the deeper bass, it sounds like this. Um, together with two would sound like one, two, three, four. Together with three would be one, two, three, four. And together with four would sound like one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two. Now the next step is getting the eighth notes together, so one, and two, two and three, and so on. So one, two, here's the and of one. One, two, three, four. <clears throat> the and of two. The and of three. And a four. Okay, so what we want to do is get fluent with all of these different rhythms and eventually play, of course, play them on other strings with chords and with little melodies. But basically, uh, like a single note melody, for example, is going to be. Um, a mixture, a combination of all of these different rhythms together. So we want to get fluent at doing them all. So let's just run through the quarter notes together in time. One, two, three, four. On one. Two. Three. 
free. And four. Okay, and again the eighth notes. One, two, three, four. The end of one. The end of two. The end of three. And the end of four. What you got to do is spend a lot of hours just playing through all of those variations and just get comfortable with them uh, so you don't have to think about it. And then uh, we're going to move on to the next half of this workshop, Free Your Fingers Part 2. So stick around and uh, have fun. Thanks. <laughs>